Let's discuss on the physical properties of lead. Lead is a bluish grey metal with a bright luster. Lead is soft and can be cut with a knife and drawn into a wire and rolled into a sheet. Lead is not a good conductor of heat and electricity. It marks paper. If we talk about the chemical properties of lead, first one is action of air. Action of air is unaffected by dry air but in moist air a layer of lead carbonate or lead hydroxide is deposited on its surface which protects it from further action of air. When heated in air or oxygen lead is oxidized to lead oxide and red lead. Either this one or this one. Action of water. Lead is not attacked by pure water in the absence of air, but water containing dissolved air has a solvent action on it due to the formation of lead hydroxide. So, lead with oxygen plus water provides lead hydroxide. It's a poisonous substance. This phenomenon is called as Plumbo solvency. Action of acids. Dilute sulfuric acid and HCl have no action on lead. Hot concentric sulfuric acid liberates sulfur dioxide. But the reaction is retarded by the formation of an insoluble lead sulfate. You can see the lead sulfate here. So lead plus sulfuric acid, it's concentrated sulfuric acid, liberates lead sulfate, water and sulfur dioxide. Action of acids. Concentrated HCl evolves hydrogen and also form chloroplumbic acid. So lead and HCl provide lead chloride and hydrogen and my lead chloride reacts with the hydrochloric acid provides chloroplumbic acid 